Jonathan from Bullet Motorsports, and I'm proud to present another 1987 Buick Grand National. This one is very special, original paint, 4,800 miles. We still have original documentation from the temp tag from when it was bought new. We have the window sticker and a binder this big with documentation. If you want to find out full details on this beautiful original 4,800 mile Grand National, click on the link below. Thanks again. Overall condition, I'd rate this easily a 9 out of 10. And that is hard to say for most Grand Nationals because the paint from factory was horrible. This one shows exceptionally well. I ran a paint meter around it. We're running between three and four and a half mils, which would be factory. It has not been repainted. All of your badging is still proper. You do have a little bit of tarnishing on the top, which kind of signifies that, hey, this is, this is original. It hasn't been pulled off. Wheels and tires are in great shape. All the chrome for your wheels, excellent. Uh, replacement center caps, which is fine because they do fall apart. The tires. These tires are still original. They're the Goodyear Eagle GTs, and there's no dry rot. So I think that we can actually do a test drive for you today and let you see it rolling down the road, just no highway driving. And if you want to drive this back home, which you shouldn't, because this is a collector piece, get new tires and you'll be good to go. Trunk bay is extremely clean. I'm looking at the most important part of a car like this. Obviously, we have full documentation window sticker, the original uh, paperwork from when it was purchased, the warranty card, the salesman who sold it to them. We have everything documented, but here's your SPID. So this is gonna give you in an alphabetical order all of your options. You're gonna be looking for the WE2 option, which is right here, which signifies Grand National. And that kind of gives you peace of mind, even though we do have all of the other documents that are gonna be included with the sale and in the gallery below. Looking down the passenger side of this 4,800 mile beauty, it's straight as an arrow, both sides are the same. All of your rubber trim throughout all the glass is very nice, original, and supple. Uh, interior is super clean. You even have the, uh, I think Kerbin used to sell it. It's a pad for your elbow. We'll show you that later when we get inside there. Only imperfection I really see is a small, minute door ding that you probably won't even catch in the pictures, but it's right here. Remember, this is lacquer paint, so you're going to have, if you put a car cover on it, it's going to get scratched. So you have to be very careful with this. Always keep a nice coat of wax on it. Uh, bumper fillers have been replaced already with uh, looks like spool fools. This is a turnkey collector piece that you can actually drive if you put new tires on it. But don't do that because they're only original once. This will be worth a lot of money in the future. Let's take a look at the interior. So all of your door cards are very nice. You do have power windows, concert sound, ice cold air, and the center console is very nice. This is just a aftermarket piece that another company sells. Let's put that outside. Glove box is very clean. Your shifter is proper. It's not loose. Ashtray is very nice. No one's ever smoked in it. The only add-on that I see, which is just a plug-in add-on, you have a scan master here, which is great because it's going to give you temperature. It's going to tell you if you're detonating. Uh, that was a precaution that the, uh, that the owner wanted to do. In case he goes to a car show, he can see everything that's going on because everything here is just a warning, no oil light, warning, uh, you know, check engine. That's it. This is going to give you a lot more features. The gauge pod is perfect. The door, when you close it, it's solid because all the rubbers are very nice. Windows aren't rattling. The plastic holding the, the actual windows that go up and down are not cracked. Your dash is proper. It's painted, or it's not painted actually. This is the original dash cover right here. Your center section is very nice. And my favorite part, when you start it, you have that analog boost and RPM gauge. And it's just beautiful. So orange and green for your RPM. Your turbo boost gauge is red and I can't wait to put it into boost. Very minimal boost, because we're on original tires. We're just gonna do a, ro a roll around the block so you guys get some beautiful outside shots. Let's show you the engine. Let's take a look under the hood. So this was the Corvette Killer, C4 Killer back then. This is a 3.8 liter single turbo intercooled motor. It produces 360 foot-pounds of torque, so that's what made it so amazing. And that's in stock form, 14 pounds. You do a Kenny Bell chip, uh, some supporting mods, and you, you have over 400 foot-pounds of torque, easy all day. This is a very nice clean example. You do not have the Power Master installed right now, but we are gonna include it. It does have a new washer reservoir as well, and most likely that's just from age, they replaced it to look really nice. We do have a chrome cover for the actual um, Garrett turbocharger, but that is the original one right there. When I'm looking at the engine bay, you still have the proper wires. We keep the bulb out so that you don't burn out if you go to a show. Um, Garrett numbers are on the intercooler still and you're going to notice in the photos there are a set of aftermarket clamps for the turbo the reason for that is for safety we're going to include the originals but sometimes they pop off because this is a very low mileage piece so we have a set of aftermarket ones there but the originals are included please take a look at the link below that has everything you'd ever want to find out about this car underside shots full gallery 
all the documentation. You want to buy this if you're a collector. Before we go for a test drive, I want to thank you guys for watching this video. If you enjoy this content, click like and subscribe below. And if you don't, click dislike. I don't care. What's this? Oh, it's our Turbo 6 snapback. So if you enjoy cool merchandise, click on our link below. Hi. So we're going to take this for a spin. Uh, this has super low mileage, so we're probably just going to put one or two miles on it. Uh, take it for... So we're taking this 87 for a spin, 4,846 miles on it. We're gonna add two additional miles. I want you guys to see that it shifts through the gears, that everything operates. Right now I have the windows closed because it's ice cold. Steering is very tight because it has 4,000 miles on it. Steering wheel feels good. Your radio works as it should. The power antenna works. That's a huge plus right there. I've, I haven't seen one of those work for a long time. This does have an equalizer with the Concert Sound 2 stereo. I love the pad for drivability purposes. The seats feel very comfortable. There are no check engine lights illuminated or, or the single check engine light illuminated. Your scan master is working as it should. We're driving it on Marina Mile right now. We're going 35 miles an hour. Surprisingly, no, no soft spots at all. Turn signals are working as they should. Headlights work. Horn works. Just a beautiful piece. Of course, the BMW wants to try us out. I'm just kidding. We're about to go over the bridge here on Marina Mile, so you're going to see how it reacts. I don't hear a single sound from this suspension. No funny noises, no funny smells. Air condition is ice cold. This is a true piece of art. By the way, we are five minutes from the Fort Lauderdale Airport, so if you want to fly in to take a look at it or if you want to send an inspector, you're more than welcome to do so. The history on this one, so we, we, we didn't acquire this one. This is consigned by a, a good client of ours. He is a hot-blooded Italian, and he did not want to deal with comments or questions. So that's what we're here for. So if you guys have a vehicle like this, um, low mileage Grand National or something very special and you don't want to deal with the end user, you're more than welcome to contact us. We can tell you how our program works and go from there. But in regards to this one, it's driving straight as an arrow. Brakes feel good as well. Turn signal for the left is working. We're going to go over some bumps shortly so you guys can see how the suspension reacts and then we're going to put it away until it's sold. If you guys have any additional questions, give us a call at 954-363-2261. See if it how boost builds. Oh, so that's only five pounds of boost. I don't really want to floor it because it's such low mileage. We're going to turn right here shortly. You guys will be see how the suspension reacts, and then if you guys have any additional questions, don't hesitate to give us a call 954 363 2261. My favorite parts about Grand Nationals when I was growing up, these were the epitome of cool for me in high school. And uh, the only things that we could afford were the WE4 cars that were, you know, back then $2,500. And it's a privilege to be able to sit in a car like this that has 4,000 miles, shows extremely well, has original paint, all the badges are proper, and all the documentation. So click on the link below so you can see all the documentation. That's what made me want to take this car on consignment. Normally we don't take cars like this on consignment. Normally they're a little bit more expensive. But when you see something this beautiful and this original, and such low mileage, that's when you have to jump and go, okay, I want to do a video of this car because it is just so perfect. And I'm very happy to be in this car right now. We'll be going over the bump shortly so you can see how it reacts. First set are two individual bumps, and then there's a big dip so you can see how the suspension moves. So this still has all original suspension. Big dip. It's so firm. It feels like you're driving a couch. Yeah, it feels good. Nice and peppy, very responsive. Exact, you feel the torque. You feel the 360 foot pounds of torque. And uh, that's all you guys are getting. Let's get some artistic shots. Once again, if you have any questions, please give us a call, 954-363-2261. Also, if you like this type of content, uh, please click like and subscribe because that's gonna give you more great cars just like this.